and welcome to this week's Stay Home Science with ASC. Today we're going to be thinking about how and why it rains. For this, you will need a clear jar, a small cup, blue food colouring, shaving foam, cold water and a pipette or syringe. Fill the jar around three quarters full with cold water. Add some water and food colouring into the small cup and give it a mix. Use shaving cream to make a nice and fluffy cloud on top of the jar. Now we're ready to make it rain. Use the pipette or syringe to suck up some of the coloured water. Slowly add it to the shaving foam cloud. Keep adding more and more coloured water into your cloud and keep watching to see it rain. So, what happened there? Well, let's take a look at the water cycle to find out. The shaving foam represents clouds. Clouds are formed when water is heated up by the sun. This makes the water turn from liquid into gas and it rises up into the air. This is called evaporation. Once high up in the sky, the gas begins to cool down and turns back into a liquid. This is called condensation. The water droplets form clouds high up in the sky and these become heavy and eventually fall from the sky in the form of rain, snow or sleet and this is called precipitation. This is similar to when you added more and more coloured water to your cloud. It got heavier and heavier until it couldn't hold any more. When it got completely full, it began raining in the jar and this is what happens in the air. This rain is then collected in streams, rivers or even in the sea. And then it's ready to be evaporated, starting the cycle again. Thanks for watching, see you next time.